Ooh, okay. Hmm. We have to come and say hi before you start digging through stuff. Mitch is hey, here. Everybody. He's going to pick out my makeup. <laughs> <laughs> You know what's funny? I thought he was going to win by a landslide when I did the poll for this I know, I live. Won. But he, he was neck and neck with a matte makeup look. So I think we're going to, he's going to try to find a matte eyeshadow palette. I'm not going to help him at all. He's just going to, he's like down in like a sea of makeup. So good morning. He's going to pick out whatever he's going to pick out. I am not going to help him at all. So wish him luck. But while he's doing that, I'm going to put my SPF on really quick. It's the one that I use pretty much every weekend at this point. It's the Artless Glow Base from Heimish. Oh, hello in Vegas. Ooh. Morgan, I'm so happy you made it to a live too. Hi from Switzerland. Wow. No, you can't shake our table so much. Oh, You're sorry. going to make people motion sick. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Adrian. Mm. Hi, Daniela. Okay, so I'm just gonna put my sunscreen on. Hi, Carrie. Melissa wishes you good luck. Oh, thank you, Melissa. Tell Melissa, thank you. Thank you, Melissa. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing, so it's gonna be interesting. Oh, man. Good morning, Rachel. Hi from Egypt. Mitch actually, Whoa, speaking I... of where I want to go more than anything. Mitch wants to go to Egypt so bad. Nicole from Philly. Wow. All over the place. I love it. Yay, Isabella, you made it. Amanda, you bought the Laguna bronzer. Nice. You have to let me know how you like it. Hey, shaky mix Shakerson. What did I shake? <laughs> Mitch is like a... <laughs> <laughs> Mitch is like a bull in a china shop. <laughs> you know, literally, like, he'll walk through, like somewhere like my makeup table for example and just knock stuff over so right if you see the camera shaking it's my fault it's his fault it's not mine my okay so problem. already from hunching over. <clears throat> there's so much makeup here it's insanity well yes there's a lot of makeup but you okay. should pick through some new stuff too to show them oh okay oh but you already have this going on yeah oh you know what i wasn't even paying attention he actually has a, a really cute little pile going on. I would show you, but then it's going to take me a while to like set the camera back up and I'm going to be shaking and it's going to be a lot of motion sickness. Is okay. This no, is this all the no stuff? No, it's just all new, like brand new hasn't been touched. <laughs> I got to show you, you could, guys this. This is insane. You can pull through there. Yeah. I have to, this is all new stuff that I have to look through. I mean, this is ridiculous. <laughs> My job is not easy today, everybody. No, his job is not. He's complaining that his job's not easy. Mine isn't either because I have to fill in my eyebrows. I did not get to finish them off camera like I usually try to do. But anyway, while he's picking out my makeup, I'll try to answer questions. Mm. And, um, oh, thank you. I think he's handsome too. Obviously. So I'm going to finish up my brows. And I have to say, you guys don't know it yet because it's not out, but I did a whole... Um, full face using all Patrick Ta Beauty. And I got this brow pencil. The video's not out yet. We're editing it. It's going to be out probably in like two weeks from now. But I got his brow pencil. Mm -hmm. And it's unbelievable. Mm -hmm. It is so good that I'm debating filling my entire makeup kit with all these brow pencils. Like it's a super fine tip pencil. It's really pigmented. <laughs> He did not pick my brow. I know he's, you know, we gotta go a little easy on him. So I'm. that's why I'm finishing them while he's collecting my makeup he wants me to use. But this brow pencil, long story short, is fantastic. Like amazing. Mm -hmm. That's pretty. I'm not gonna help you out though. The only thing, I don't know all the things I need to get though. Well, you'll see as I, I do a makeup look, you'll see like if I'm missing anything. You're gonna do this one for your foundation. I think that's what the foundation is, right? Yep. All right, so Mitch has already picked out a foundation and I'm really happy he chose this because I've been wanting to use this more. I just got this recently. It's the Tower 28 Sunny Days Broad Spectrum SPF 30 and I have the shade PCH. So I'm gonna put this on actually a second once I... Are you gonna do your eyes first or are you gonna do foundation first? Whatever you hand me. Why don't you do your eyes first? Okay, Mitch wants me to do my eyes first. It's gonna be, I think, I don't know, is monochromatic the right way to say it? Yeah. 
Like this? No, he's thinking monochromatic. You already picked out your lip color. Amanda, you what? Oh, did you watch the um, TikTok makeup trends? That was a really fun video. Okay, my brows are, are good. I don't know why they're not looking super even to me on camera. Ooh. Okay, brows are done for now. I will link everything that Mitch chooses for me. Hi from Brazil, wow. Beauty by Brittany. Oh yeah, Brittany, you had to work last Sunday. Well, mm -hmm. welcome to this live. I'm gonna give one thing to Mitch because he just gave me this uh, Givenchy powder that I love, but this is a brand new one that I'm gonna put in my makeup kit, so I'm just gonna switch oh. it out for the one that I've been using. I see. He says, oh. Um, you wanna give me a primer or anything? What are you thinking? That's primer. No, I don't like primer. Hey, he doesn't like primer, okay. All right, then I'm gonna put this on. Eyeshadow. Because you gave me this. Then you do eyeshadow first. But you gave, you handed All me right, this first. All right, you do that one first, uh, you do that one first. We're gonna play fair. I'm trying not to give you a, a, a leg up here. Okay, so I'm just gonna put this on my palette and I'm gonna grab one of my favorite brushes. You have to do this on your brows. You want me? Okay, he says I have to put this on my brows. I'll put this on in a second then. But let's get this Tower 28 tinted moisturizer on. So I really like this and I, um, I don't know why it took me so long to try it. Well, I do know why it took me so long because I have so many things like for <laughs> complexion. I just don't need more, but I'm really happy I finally picked this up because it's really nice. I think it works really well for oily skin. This has a little more, a little more of a satin finish, like where you can make it more of a satin finish easier than most tinted moisturizers. I just find that a lot of tinted moisturizers just are way, there's no dry down and that really bothers me because like I said, I do have more combination oily skin or I guess more normal to oily skin. And you know, I, just, I don't like that feeling. I wanna have my, my base feel like it's dried down a bit. Um, somebody asked how we met or how we started dating. We met on set and you know what? It's kind of a long story, but we, long story short, we met on set. <laughs> Um, I think I've talked about before. I know I have a lot of new people um, to my channel as of recently. In fact, I kind of want to talk about that. But before I do, I just want to say a little bit goes a long way. I always end up pumping out way too much of this Tower 28. And now I feel like I'm going to waste half of that amount, which sucks. Like this actually gives really good coverage. Has anyone tried this? And do you like it? Okay, Mitch has a good pile. Okay, these are the two blushes, right? Yeah. I should ask them. You should show what them. blush do you guys like better? This <laughs> Dior one or this NARS one? Here, let me show you guys. Oh. <laughs> oh. Daniela, I I Okay, so Mitch needs to vote first really quick. And then I want to talk to, I want to talk Dior. about the BK beauty brushes. Yeah, it's too oily for me. NARS. NARS. Okay, so we have one Dior, one NARS. What are you leaning towards? Dior. Dior. Mattes. Oh, Adrian Matt. says Matt. Is that this one? Uh, no, that's Shimmer. This is Matt. Oh, wow. We're getting a lot of NARS now all of a sudden. Whoa. NARS, Dior. Oh, gosh. We should do a poll. Oh, well, we kind of are. <laughs> Which one do you like? Do you like Shimmer or do you like Matt? Well, I, I want to do a matte look. Will you pick me out a concealer? A concealer? Okay. Where, where is that at? Where's your pile? I'm not going to tell you. What? I'm not going to tell you. You oh, you have... Oh, yeah. Here's a concealer. Right? That's a whole bin of concealers. Okay. He found the concealers, guys. We're getting so, so many even amounts of NARS I know. and Dior. Okay. While he's doing that, he did tell me he wants me to use this. So I'm going to use... Such a good trick. The... Got to be glued, the OG one that I used to use all the time until I got the, um, let me show you it. Until I got this, which is on Amazon, it's like 10 bucks and it's so good. No, he's not picked my lip shade yet, but you know what? I have a feeling he's yeah, gonna yeah. try it. Oh, he did? Oh, never mind. He did pick it out. Wow. Would okay. she, would, would they say that, have a feeling what? 
Amanda, well, I was going to say, I have a feeling you're going to pick out, you're going to sit, tell me to put concealer on my lips because that's what you like. <laughs> <laughs> Mitch, Mitch loves a nude, like a super nude lip. It's so funny. Okay, we're getting more Dior votes. I, I'd say, honestly, it's a tie, to be totally okay, honest. Then, is it, are we doing matte or shimmer? Well, what do you mean? For what? For the blush. I guess that's the question. Huh? Just stressed out. Being, hey, <sighs> you, you, the shaking. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, everybody. It's my first day. Okay. It's, it's his first day on the job. I think he was really bummed that he um, won the poll. No, I was excited. Oh, you were excited? Okay, good. I thought I was going to get more of a landslide. To... Me. All right. All right, my, br my brows are in. Classic. My brows Matt. are done. Matt blush, please. Hmm. Matt, Tristan says me. Go Matt. I agree. Okay. That's what I want to stick to. All right, we're going to stick to Matt. Even though I do like this, everybody. Okay, and he picked out a concealer. And this too, you have so. to do this one. Oh, what, what, you didn't tell me which one to it's do the first. It's the and Prime. Okay. Right, isn't that the concealer? That's the... Um, brightening one? That's brightening one, brightening yeah. one, yeah. Yeah, that's it. I like that one. I know. I could feel Mitch's anxiety, too. Oh, really? A little bit. Uh, Jessica, he picked out an eyeshadow palette, and it's something that I just got in PR. I'm really excited. It's the matte Huda Beauty eyeshadow palette. It's the Cool Matte Obsessions palette. So let's open it up. <laughs> you look so sad down there. Well, it's, I'm trying to find You look really sad. <laughs> it's got a glimpse of you in the corner. You look... <laughs> First of all, you're in a shadow and I feel really bad. <laughs> okay, this is it. Let me show you before I uh, you know, dive into it. How pretty is that? Ooh. Really pretty. All matte. He looks like, he looks like Mario Kim K's Mega Oh, that's funny. <laughs> that's a compliment. Oh, yes, it's a compliment for sure. He's that, it's a handsome man. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> so I need a, a, a brush from my concealer. Please. Oh, but, oh yeah, this is where we're going to challenge you now. Amanda, Here's what did you buy at Ulta for over 400 bucks? No, you can't. Come on. That's what you have to use. I can't use this for my concealer. Okay, That's let me wrong. ask them real, close, uh, real quick. Hold on a second. <laughs> because I think you should only be able to allow to use three brushes today. Or give me You're going to use this one? Okay, fine. It's big. All and right. you're going to get a medium size one? I'm out my brushes. But I need something for my and concealer. you're going to get a small one here. That one. But what about for eyeshadow? This I one. I need one That's more. What you got. All right. Those are the brushes you get. All right, to Mitch today. is giving me these to use today. And that's it. That's Apparently, he's trying to make this more of like a, you know, challenge. Well, I don't think everybody has every brush known to mankind. This is very true. So I'm actually going to use this is a great brush for concealer. It's a 108 from BK Beauty. Okay. Oh, you do get to use a, 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 a sponge because he's pretty nice. I agree, Amanda. Good for you for splurging. But I just hope you got really great stuff. And I'm just curious what you bought at Ulta. And if there's oh. something that I need, let me know. Which is producer Sin and director today. Yes, he is. is. On again. Oh, she's she's our oh, she's our OG fan. Yeah. Okay. What about this for bronzer? What is this? Is this bronzer? Ask him. Yeah. Well, no, it's not. What is this? That is a. And Jessica, I have a code for BK Beauty now. By the way. I linked in my last live, but I'll link it again in this one. Um, all right, my concealer's done, babe. Concealer's done? You gotta use the Prep and Prime one. Okay, fine, I'll use the Snow too. It's like the Iron Chef of makeup. Yeah, you know, this actually gives me, uh, this is like Chopped. This oh. reminds me of Chopped. Did you guys ever watch Chopped on Food Network? I love that show. He's getting overwhelmed by the amount of products to choose from. Yes, he is. <laughs> Seriously. He's Seriously. like choking. He's, he's just. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did you do any skincare? He's all over the place. I know. I already did my skincare. I thought that would be easier. Okay. okay. I'm going to use this to brighten my brow bone and to clean up under my brows. I actually started doing this recently because I was doing my makeup once I got to work. Like once I was parked, I love to do that. It just kind of how I do my makeup throughout the week. And I forgot to bring a concealer to like clean up under my brows, which I really like to do. So I used this and it worked really, really well. 
I only have one request for your eyes. I still watch Chop 2 sometimes. What's your request? You're going to do a fox eye. Foxy. Oh, you want to do a fox eye. I want you to do the inner corner and the outer corner. Okay. <laughs> With liquid liner. Or do you better find a liquid liner. I'm I not, I am not going to help you find a liquid liner. Nobody, nobody tell him where the liquid eyeliner is, please. I don't feel like doing it. Oh, yeah, the eye calls are good. Oh. Teddy, do you like this one? I do like Teddy. All right. Oh, Blue Ridge. Watch you from Blue Ridge, mm -hmm. Georgia. Nice. Thank you for joining us. Oh, this is the look I was about to find out. Oh, thank you, Maggie. Maggie says we're an attractive couple. Oh. That's very sweet of you. We appreciate it. You know, hmm. he should know a lot about makeup at this point because, you know, he just, he watches me do my makeup every weekend. So, <laughs> <laughs> hello from North Carolina. I heard North Carolina is beautiful. All right. Mm -hmm. So, he is like a child in a, a toy store. Right now, he's holding a bunch of setting sprays for some reason. I'm not, babe, I'm so far away from that point. I know, but I'm just trying to figure it out. Maybe. Okay. So, I'm going to, since he's not giving me a lot more products yet. Wait, but what else do we need, though? Well, I'm going to set my under eyes so before I do my um, yeah. eyeshadow. Okay. So I'm going to use my Givenchy. Oh, this goes good he this. gave me the Prisma Libre powder, my favorite powder. It's so funny because like, when we film and he sees me use this powder to set my makeup, he always goes, wow. Mm -hmm. Wow. That's crazy. Okay, I'm gonna grab. Oh, can I use this? Yeah, that's how you brought it up. Okay, thank I you. I have it right here. Oh, I'm gonna use this one that I've lightly used already. Gina is from England watching. That's mm -hmm. awesome. This powder is amazing, Amanda. It's just, honestly, I know it's expensive, but it is just, there's nothing like it. I mean, there, listen, I like a lot of powders, but this powder is just unreal. It really is just unreal. A new mascara? Yeah. I gotta open a new mascara. I don't know, it just seems fun. All right. Looks okay. a little strange though, to be honest. Which wants me to open a brand new mascara? Ooh, who hmm. has this? Thing? Clearly he doesn't remember that I was trying to use up all my old, my ones that are already open before I open up a new one. <laughs> Guys, I am running so low on this powder. I might need to take that one that I was going to put in my kit and give it to myself, to be honest. Just go out and buy another one later. My hoops are from this... Um, I want to say they're a UK brand. They're they're called Ask and Embla. I want to say oh, is the name. Okay. Oh, that's weird. Lee, this powder is just a little more fine-milled than the Huda Beauty one. Than the... um like the easy bake powders. I, you know, I love both. I absolutely love, love both. I think both are incredible formulas. One's obviously much more pricey, which is the Givenchy. Which shade do I recommend? Mm. I have a light neutral complexion with rosy rosacea cheeks. Well, Amanda, I love this one specifically for the T-zone and the under eye. It's pink. I know you're saying you have rosacea, but if you want to use it specifically to set your under eyes, I think that is totally fine. If you want one that's like all over and then might also give you a little bit of like neutralization, get the number four. The number four has a little bit of green mix in it, which will actually help to reduce redness. So that could be good for you. Oh, he's coming in with his, his, uh, his chair. Well, I, can I do my blush? Yep. Oh, you're on blush already? Yeah. Bronzer. This is my bronzer? Well, you have to do a cream and then a powder, no? This one? Is this your... No, that's the foundation. This is foundation? Yeah. Oh. He's talking about the yummy skin. Well, where's cream. the where's the cream bronzer? Uh, can't show you. I I'm just gonna start using what you've given me. You know what? While he's doing that, while he's figuring out life, I'm gonna use the new palette from Huda Beauty. He gave me one brush to use, so I'm gonna use this one very wisely. It's the BK Beauty A503 brush. I wanna see something dramatic. <laughs> what? You wanna see something dramatic? Mm -hmm. Well, tell me which color to use first then. Let's see if they see if they vote for anything here. Okay, I oh. like pretty much everything here. Okay. I mean, I like this these two, but you do this all the time. I think you should stick to this general region here and this one maybe. Okay. You know? Well, tell me what color to start with. 
So that's going to start kind with, of... You have to start with light, so you start with the center one. Okay. We're going to start with the center one. It's like a soft pastel pink. I have not used this palette. It's brand new to me. It looks pretty. Do you want this to be like monochromatic, like all pink all over? You're going to do your thing. I'm just going to pick the colors. All right. Well, then you got to tell me what my next color is. The next color is this one here, the center top one. Oh, nice. You love the Givenchy powder? That's amazing. I honestly would be shocked if you didn't. I really would. I use that on so many of my clients at on all different ages, and it works incredible. Top one. Oh, well, I have to do this I know, too. I have okay. to even this out. Hold on. Can't move it. I'll have some. Gina says, good job, Mitch. Keep going. Oh, nice. Keep it going. Thanks, Gina. He says, thank you, Gina. What is your method for setting a reminder to throw out mascara tubes? Um, well, you know what? The easiest way, and this is what I do in my professional makeup kit, even though, to be quite honest, I run out before the expiration comes around, you're supposed to throw them out within three months, or three months is the, the max amount that you are recommended to use them. Now, in my makeup kit, like the ones I use professionally, I run out way before three months. I run out within probably like five weeks. So, but let's say I have a waterproof formula. Those take me a little bit longer to run out of in my makeup kit. Those I'll just Sharpie. Or you have like, they have like um, little paint markers that you can like white or gold or whatever. And I'll use like a paint marker and I'll just write the date on it. So that way I know when I opened it and I put it in my kit. Okay, this is blending on like a dream. I really like this color. This is really pretty. I was really excited to try this this new palette from Huda. <laughs> uh, hi, Nikki. I was at Sephora last night. I told all the girls that worked there about you last night. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Oh, my God. That's sweet. Are you serious? Thank you. <laughs> that is like the sweetest thing ever. I appreciate that so much. You know, speaking of you guys, um, so long story short, I had to work all day yesterday and then Mitch and I were in Newport Beach and uh, we actually got to go to one of our favorite restaurants. And uh, we, so I, we walked in or I walked in <laughs> and I got recognized by someone who watches my YouTube and it was the sweetest thing on the planet. So shout out to Judy, who's oh, so beautiful. Judy. Yeah, so beautiful. This is the sweetest person on earth. Honestly, she made my whole day. I mean, my face was like, I can't take a compliment. So like my face, I could feel my face was like bright red and like, and hot. And then her beautiful daughter, Brooke, oh, I got to meet her. Sweet. Oh my gosh. And then Mitch was talking to the husband. They were just so sweet. So shout out to Judy and Brooke. Thank mm -hmm. you guys for saying hi to me and for being just like the sweetest people on earth. So really appreciated that. She was so sweet. She was so sweet. Oh, my God. And I was just shocked to get, you know, it's, it's like shocking when you get recognized, to be honest. It happens. The only time it really happens is if I am in a Sephora. I've gone in Ulta, too, but... And also Nordstrom, for some reason. Nordstrom, I'll always get... I'll, every time I go to this one Nordstrom in L.A., I get recognized. Like, no joke. It's happened to me three times. Um, okay. okay. I gotta choose one more color. All right, he's gotta choose another color. Sorry. What did you do so far? I just did that middle color. I just recently... the middle color? You're supposed to do the top one here. This one's your next one. Oh, okay. Well, you didn't tell colors. me that. I, said, I did say that. Okay. Apparently, I have to use this one now. Okay, so we're going to use this. Is this a cream? Oh, this is the cream one, babe. That's not good. Oh, no. It's great. I can't wait to use this. Okay, so in these palettes, all of these are matte, but these two up top are cream. Like a matte finish cream formula. I'm going to use my fingertip because he didn't give me many tools. And we're going to... Pat it on. Oh, wow. Wow. That is such a cool, mm. that is such a cool idea. You know, Huda Beauty is pretty innovative, I gotta say. I love a lot of their products. Wow. That is so pretty. Any tips on how to reapply sunscreen throughout the day over perfectly beautiful makeup? Well, here's the problem. <laughs> I'll be really real with you. It is very difficult to reapply sunscreen 
and not ruin perfectly or beautifully applied makeup. I know this firsthand because I've tried to do it for years. The only, okay, so two options. I'm gonna give you two options. Now, I don't know if I believe in them wholeheartedly, like in terms of like, I don't believe in their, I'm not sure I believe in their, the protection these products are providing wholeheartedly, but you could do one of two things. Um, the brand Kula has a setting spray that has SPF 30 in it. That's a really great, quick and easy way to reapply your sunscreen. Now, I don't know how much protection it's really giving you because it's diluted in like a liquid form, but that's a good option. The other option would be they make tons of, I wanna say they're mineral-based powders that have contain SPF, like SPF 30 or 40. One, they have so many from Supergoop that I know a lot of people love. Um, you could try that. The other thing that I typically do is I just put a hat on. So, okay, do this one next. Okay, Mitch is gonna run. Mitch is brushing me. This one what? Does. This one in your corner. In my corner? Like like with a pencil brush? No, whatever, yeah. All I right, fine. So thing. he only gave me two brushes, you guys. So I'm gonna use the BK Beauty 207. It's like a, kind of like a large pencil brush. But I like your eyes right now. They look so pretty. Well, it's too bad. Wait, this one? No, this that one? one, yeah. Okay, all right. He says I have to use this one, gladly. I'm gonna just kind of smoke out the bottom lash line a little bit. Do they not make like sunscreens that are setting sprays? Well, they do. That's one I was just mentioning. It's from the brand Kula. What is everyone doing today? Apparently Mitch is done picking out makeup because now he's just sitting and he's just I was looking chilling. for questions. Do I have more things oh, he's to looking for, He's looking for questions, okay. Did we miss any questions while we were in the chaos of picking out makeup? Cindy, you're doing laundry. I have a load of laundry that I need to rewash because you know what I did? I washed a bunch of towels, left them in the washing machine, and now they smell like mildew and I have to rewash them. So I gotta do that. That's literally your thing. That's my thing. He's apparently that's my thing. Milani spray sunscreen smells like sunscreen, but it feels like it doesn't mess up my makeup. Oh, I didn't know Milani had one. That's really good to know, Amanda. Hi, Lauren. Rachel gets a lazy Sunday. You lucky. Yes, my question is in two parts. Okay, Tristan, tell me the rest of your question, please. I already went to the Hollywood Farmer's Market. Wow. <laughs> Reorganizing my bedroom. Oof, that sounds hard. You can also throw some baking oh. soda in with the towels. Really? But what does that do? Like when I rewash them, you mean? I wonder if it kills them. Does it kill the bacteria? Hi, Aaron. Because Mitch is like the um, mildew detector. <laughs> you know, what? it's so funny. He would he can detect mildew from like a mile away. My husband picked up my picked my makeup yesterday. Oh, that's sweet. Gosh, that's so sweet. Vivian voted for Dior. Dior. Okay. Sorry I'm late. Sounds like fun today. It's all good, Aaron. We're gonna save this. Hopefully mm -hmm. that this is hopefully this is entertaining. Question from Jory. How do you feel about the hourglass veil setting spray over wax slash cream based makeup? Over wax slash cream based makeup. Great. I think I've I haven't had a problem with it. Um have you had a problem with it? Is that what you're asking? I think it works I think that setting spray works incredibly well on like Honestly, like every formula I've I've tried in my makeup kit and on myself, it works great. Waiting on the grandkids Aww. to go to the park. Oh, that sounds like a great day. You guys were in Southern California and it poured rain this morning, like unexpectedly. Aaron's asking the best universal color of G Givenchy, Givenchy powder for my kit. Universal. You know, four would be the most universal. It has like a, it's, it's, it basically shows up translucent. I have used that one on deep skin tones, but it's not, it's not universal. It's not gonna work on deep, dark skin tones. Um, so it's, it's not universal. It's universal if you're mm. fair to medium, medium heading towards dark, but it's not universal. Um, but if you fit those categories, those, uh, lighter shade categories, then it's, it is more universal. 
Um, but luckily they have a great shade range for everyone. And I have them all in my kit and they're phenomenal. I think you need a highlighter. I do need a highlighter. Where's the highlighter? I don't know so there's highlighters blush. mixed in that. In here? Yeah, those are blushes and highlighters. I'm. Can I put on my Dior or can I put on bronzer? You're supposed to, aren't you, what about contour and bronzer and stuff? You didn't pick it up for me. I don't know what, what they are though. I can't help you. But you have to like point me in the right direction. Well, you should show these people how many how many things I have. To listen, I'll take. I would show you guys the sea of makeup that he has to dig through. Ooh. No, that's not that's not my color. That is like Casper. There's a lot of makeup he has to choose from. I know this is not the easiest thing for him, but I need. Oh, I need I this mascara. Some good ones so far. Okay, so this is a mascara he picked out. Just FYI, it's brand new. This is the Maybelline Curl Bounce. The Colossal Curl Bounce. Will this show up? Yes. I like the packaging. Okay, he picked out a highlighter. Okay, I won't do the mascara yet then. I'm gonna finish my some of my face products. This is the About Face Light Lock Powder in the shade Stay in Bed. Mm. Are you gonna do it inner corner? Why you tell me? <laughs> no, you're supposed to do whatever you want. I'm just... Uh... All right, but you know, you didn't give me a, a highlighter brush. Do I have to use this? Yeah, and you have to do the oh, inner on. corner one. Yeah, you have, listen. But then it's gonna not be everybody has so many brushes. Messy, but babe, I need like one more brush. What do you need? I what, need a small. small okay, get this brush. brush. No, not that small. Somebody put my highlighter on. This this blush brush. For highlighter? I don't know. You said for highlighter. Well, highlighter goes in your cheeks, babe. So this is gonna be a really small brush. Well, what about in your tear duct? Well, I'll use my finger. Okay. Oh, so you need a okay, okay. So you need a highlighter brush. I get it. This one, then. Yes. You get this one. But that's a clean face brush. <laughs> I want to use this week. This. What is it? All right. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm not sure. All right. That's exactly fine. what you need, and you're kind of ruining the whole idea of me picking out your things. I think it's my first time. I'm not it ruining the whole <laughs> idea. So, I just don't want you to set me up for failure. She should make it all. So sweet. All right, guys, we have to highlight with this. <laughs> what? <laughs> just throwing you shade. Who is? Me. Oh. Gosh, all right. You got called out. <laughs> you did. I did? Yeah. Why would it happen? I called you out. You did? <laughs> I'm oblivious. Apparently. Mitch is just joining the chat right now, guys. <laughs> Mitch is just joining the chat. Uh, Brittany. Oh, Brittany. Oh, I Brittany. think about you every day. I'm not kidding you. Brittany is one of my best friends. And she's just joined the chat as well. But oh, Brittany. See, Danielle is with me. Go, Mitch. You are doing great. Oh, thank you. Okay. He's getting some love and support. Brittany, really quick. I literally think about you every day when I get off the freeway and I'm heading home. I'm like, oh, you didn't text Brittany. Oh, you didn't text Brittany. I need to see you. So bad. So let me just give you guys a little a little story time while Mitch is doing whatever he's doing. What else am I supposed to get for you? I you just feel like tell I me need what else more need. stuff, but I don't know. Maybe How not. do you need more stuff? You have bronzer? You have... I guess we'll find out. Um, I'm going to do some eyeliner. He gave me Teddy from MAC. This is a solid choice, babe. But I want... Solid I want a choice. fox eye. But he wants a fox eye. Oh, Jesus. But you gave me, like, no brushes, babe. Okay, well, tell me what brush you need. You need a small, tiny brush? Yeah. And I also want liquid liner, but I don't know where the liquid liner is. This one. What about this one? Victoria. Very Victoria. Very Victoria. No, this is... Oh, that's uh, Victoria Beckham. Um, okay, so hold on. Brittany, really quick. I I have... I've had the worst schedule on earth. Um, okay, I say that, but don't drag me for that. I'm very grateful for what I do for a living that I am busy doing makeup. However, I just want to be really honest with you guys. I have one more week of... I've been on a month-long job with one of my clients, one of my dear clients. I've been, I was with her yesterday, actually. We, we got to do a really fun, full glam look. I don't know if you saw it. I, I have a real post on my Instagram with it. But um, we have been on a month-long job, and I have to get up every single day in order to be at work at 5.15 in the morning. Like, I have to be in the building, you know, parked, ready to go, ready to do makeup at 5.15 in the morning. So I'm getting up at 4 a.m. every single day, like Monday through Friday. And it's just, oh man, it's really, like this week that we're heading into is my fourth and final week on this job. And then I'm wrapping it up. 
And then I, all my friends are mad at me. <laughs> Basically, all my friends, Mitch, everybody's mad at me because I have no social life. I'm and, not mad at you. Well, you know, you get so disappointed when I'm going, when I get up to go to bed at like 9, 15, 9, 30 at night. I don't know, that's not. Or even worse, I, w I fall asleep on the couch and then I wake up in a panic and it's like 10.30 at night and I'm like, oh, I should have been asleep. I get so upset. I'm just tired, basically. I'm just tired. I'm really tired. <laughs> and I gotta get up at 4 a.m. tomorrow. Do you what need is this? That? Yeah, but that color? You won't like that color, babe. It's a lip liner. Oh, it's a lip liner? Yeah. Oh yeah, you do need a lip liner. Okay, I need a lip liner. I need. Um, I like this color. No. You know, I really need a better brush to do a fox eye, though. Okay, I want to see a good fox eye. So tell me what you need. I need something like. Can I use this? Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. So you know what? I'm gonna try to make do with what he gave me. Okay. So it's gonna look really messy for a second. Yeah, I gave you the Meisler water to do the thing. Yeah, but you didn't give me Q-tips. Mm -hmm. Anyway, um, long story short. Uh, just just venting about my lack of sleep for the last month. That's all. I'm not trying to complain too much, but oh. I'm just tired. That's all. Anyway. Still regretting not getting your generous gift. Still regretting? Wait, what? Dream often says still regretting no getting your generous gift. Hmm. Hmm. What generous gift? And by the way, I know I hate to bring this up again. I'm going to do my giveaway. I promise you. I have a box for it. I've got bubble wrap. It's like partially ready to go. Amanda says I have social anxiety and I'm an introvert. So my friends are always upset with me for not going oh, out. Oh yeah. I feel you on that. Yep. Amanda. I don't know. So is Mitch. I don't really have too many friends either. Stop. <laughs> just... No, Mitch doesn't take time for friends. That's what his thing is. You know, and I've got like, I have a, the tiniest handful of friends. I have a lot of acquaintances, but like I have a tiny handful of like, you know, like really like, I don't like when these eyeliner's coming out. Probably because my husband set me up with the wrong tools. But Well, you got your new tool right there. Oh. Trying to make this really pretty, you guys. Oh gosh, LV says we should really say thank you so much to to Mitch for supporting Nikki and making it possible to have these oh lives my on YouTube. God. Oh my gosh, that's that so sweet. the sweetest yeah. thing we've ever heard. Yeah. Thank you. Love from Italy. Oh my gosh. Oh my God, we love Italy. Wow, my wrinkles are really bad and it's, it's so bright. <laughs> it's so bright. You need to sit. You, do this. you need to sit in front of the light because you know what? The, the light that I have, first of all, it blinds me. Like if I look into the light that's directly behind you all, I, mean, I am seeing stars for a couple seconds after. Oop, I almost poked myself in the eye because I looked in the light. <laughs> so bright it's it is really bright um you know what were we talking about i feel like it well, was you got a new question here hold on it's good so stuff tristan porter says my question what do you think about next time y'all do a live going intense tutorial wrinkles where get ready with me that i can follow along and you wait for us to help us through issues i like that, that we're having oh yeah that's a cool idea it's a really cool idea we will, will you write that down, Kenny? Will you, well. I'll screenshot it. That is a great idea. Who said that? Tristan. Tristan. Tristan Porter. Tristan, that was a great idea. I Ooh, love, cool. I love that idea. We're, listen, we're always wanting suggestions, you know? What are friends? What I know, friends? I know. I mean, seriously. Oh, it's so true. That is so true. <laughs> no, we have friends. We just, they're, you know, they're probably mad at us because we never take the time to see them. But I guess that's the long story short. It's hard, you know? It's really hard. It's hard when you work 15,000 jobs. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, this is turning out pretty. Let me see. I'm still not see. like loving can it, you go to closer be quite to the honest. So I can see? Oh, yeah, it's pretty. Okay. I think you need to do more on your inner corner, though, no? Oh, Raquel, you got chocolate cosmos? You're supposed to do black yes. eyeliner. You're gonna love you You have to tell me how you like that lipstick, please. Uh, oh, baby, you didn't give me black. Oh, yeah, you did yeah. give me. Okay, he gave me a black eyeliner. I'm going to use the, I actually like this. It's the e.l.f. Intense Ink Eyeliner. It's just a black felt pen eyeliner. It's kind of big. It is really big. <sighs> okay. All right, let me do this really quick. If you have questions that we missed, you could ask Mitch right now because mm -hmm. I'm going to have my eyes closed. Gosh, Sadie said, West says, I've been working 10 to 12 hour days at my law firm, so I don't even remember what a social life is. Wow. <laughs> yeah, for sure. 
But you know what, though? Good for you. Oh. It's Peggy awesome. Morrison says, you're so cute together. Oh, cute. That looks Thank pretty you. baby. I basically just went over the eyeshadow that I applied earlier. Really? Well, I mean, how else am I supposed to? I don't know. I wasn't really happy with the eyeshadow eyeliner and the Teddy eyeliner. Okay, hey, Duchess Marie says, what's your favorite foundation for dry skin? Well, I, okay, a couple things. Favorite foundation for dry skin is definitely the Armani Luminous Soak. Mm. By far, by far. I have it stocked in my makeup kit because I actually have a lot of dry skin clients that I work with like regularly. And that one just looks phenomenal. But let me just say something. If you have dry skin, you can use you can, this might be an unpopular opinion, unpopular opinion, you can make a more matte or set, satin finished foundation work if you just really thoroughly prep the heck out of your skin with serums, moisturizer, and then you put that on top and then you use minimal powder on top of that to set it, if that makes sense. So the Armani is my favorite as far as like for my go-to for dry skin clients. But let's say you have a foundation that's just, you know, it's more of a satin and you're trying to like, you know, get your good use out of it. Just really thoroughly prep your skin and I promise you, you can make it work. Oh. World needs more men like Mitch. God, that's so sweet. That's gonna stick with him forever. I know. That was really sweet, wow. So sweet. Nars. Okay. <clears throat> there some, she's talking about the blush. Some people were asking if I've picked a bronzer. I picked this one from Girlactic. Oh, look at him with some names. Right? Yeah. Mitch, but what was I, the first thing that you loved about Nikki? A, oh, wait, <laughs> Jessica wants to know what was the first thing you loved about Nikki? First thing I loved, wait, I loved about Nikki? Oh, gosh. She's asking you. Well, when I first saw her, it was over. And I, at this shoot, I was like, I have to know who this girl is. Like, I, I had to, like, at least talk to you, you know? Even though you did not want to talk to me at all. I didn't. I was going through a really rough time when he met me. A mm. really rough time. You know, he snuck a picture of me while I was doing makeup. Yeah. <laughs> 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 wasn't, wasn't that creepy? He's not, I know it wasn't that creepy. Um, you know what's really sweet too is my one of my besties, Brittany, was with me the day that I met Mitch. And we were both like hard at work. We were doing so many models that day. And Mitch snuck a picture. Brittany's in that picture too. Yeah. No, the first thing I think I loved about her was her love for her family. She was so close with her family. Mm. My family of two people. Yeah. Really sweet. No, he loves them. Good brush for blush. Mm. Alina asked, or Lini. Oh, this okay. eyeliner is just. Let me see. I can tell. Oh, I'm having, a, I looks pretty good. having a hard time here, guys. I didn't do your inner corner, though. I Well, I did with Teddy. You gave me so many eyeliners. I don't know. You know? I don't know what to do. Guys, I messed this up. I got distracted. And he needs some. I went way. Too high up for this hooded eye. That looks nice. All right, well, we're gonna move on to mascara. What is a good brush for powder bronzer? Gosh, so many, so many. Okay, so I'm gonna, let me show you some just really quick. I actually love, as I hit my ear, I love this, all oh, Brittany remembers that day. Um, I love this brush, or I love a, a size brush like this, density, fluffiness. I like a brush like this for powder bronzer. If you want to just have a nice natural amount of um, color, it's like, it gives you like a, the perfect amount. This one is from, the one I just pulled up by the way is from Morphe. It's like the Makeup by Ariel collaboration set. Okay, let's get some mascara on. I am not. I'm not digging my eye, my eye makeup, just to be honest. I think you need more contrast. Yeah. Do you want a darker color? Well, this mascara is nice, a little more natural. Okay, what is your favorite BK Beauty brush? The 106 currently. Mm -hmm. um, if you know me, you know I use that 106 for so many things. I use it for contour, cream blush, liquid foundation, cream foundation. You can even use it for powder. It's a really great multitasker. Like I could get, I could get most of an entire, I could probably get an entire face done with that brush to be quite honest. I should have gave you one brush. I know. Well, next time. Okay, you need bronzer, no? And contour? I do, I know. 
I'm working there. I'm, I'm getting to that point. How is this going by so fast? Finally, I see you live. Wait, um, save it with a Dior, lol. Are you, um, wait, what Dior? The Dior blush? I might have missed some of that conversation. Sorry. Sorry to just like try to jump in. Just want to make sure I'm not. Oh, yeah. Tristan says it needs a deeper shade on the outer corner. Okay. Yes, it does. Okay, I'll just see. Let's pick something. I like this one. What about this one? Oh, this one? mascara is actually really good, you guys. Wow. Um, yeah. No? How about, How about that one? How about something a little softer? Yeah. This color? Yeah. Yeah, I need more depth, but he gave me one big brush and one little tiny brush, so it's hard to build up. You know, it's hard to build it up when you give your, your lacking in tools. What are you taking into consideration when picking excuses. a bronzer color? I never know what shade to choose. Take into consideration the, your skin tone, like how dark, how fair, medium, like take into consideration what tone you fall into and then take into consideration what your undertone is as well. So if you um, are more like the cool side, you have more like pink in your skin, you could wear like a beautiful neutral or you could even wear like a warm tone bronzer and it'd be like a good compliment to your skin. If you are really on the olive side, I suggest you stay away from orangey or more red tone bronzers and you try to find one that has more like that yellow olive undertone. They are kind of hard to find, but that would be like the best compliment to your skin. They won't look too contrasting. Um, but yeah, take take everything into consideration. Take into consideration how natural do you want it to look? How impactful do you want it to look? There's a, there's a lot, I know, that goes into it. And there's so many options. This mascara is great, just side note. Dawn is asking if you can recommend a waterproof mascara. Yeah, I will post about it because my friend Sammy, she's a makeup artist, she's incredible. I was on set with her and I had run out of my um, waterproof mascara. And so I borrowed one of hers and it's like, I think it's a L'Oreal one. It's in a pink tube. It's really popular. Yeah. I'll post about it. It's in my makeup kit. I, otherwise, I would bring it out. It's in my professional makeup kit. Babe, I need a, a lip. Okay, wait, powder bronzer. We're running out of time. I gave you a lip. Okay. Oh, yeah, sorry. Okay, so I'm going to put some powder bronzer on. And I'm going to use that brush I was telling you about. So this is from Girlactic. It's the shade Casablanca. I, oh, is it Lash? Yeah, Haley. It is Lash Paradise. Good call. Remembering that name. I don't know how you, you got that from just pink too, but I guess you must be familiar with that formula. It's a great formula. Great, great waterproof formula too. That's the one that I have. Born, born word says I'm back. I am back I to take, take my face mask off. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. Okay, so how do you figure out how short to trim your eyebrows? I think it's just a personal preference. Mm. Um, I, I personally don't recommend a lot of people, a lot of people trim their brows because I think it's just nicer and easier to be able to like have longer brows and then get a clear brow gel or a tinted brow gel and then just brush them to the side. You'll get a really beautiful look that way. Do I recommend a drugstore cream bronzer? I think the e.l.f. one, it comes in like a little pot. It's like $6. Hmm. It's called like the e.l.f. Putty Bronzer. I think those are great. I use that one all the time. The bronzer which picked is so pretty. Yeah. I love this bronzer. This is like one of my go-tos like during the week when I want something that's just gonna be quick, natural, and complement my skin. What is this? I need more blood brushes. That's like a um, setting powder. I haven't tried the Makeup Revolution one. Maybelline Lash Discovery. Ooh, really? I, Lauren, I like this mascara. I think this looks really good. Let me show you up close. This is maybe two coats. I think it was really nice. And it feels nice. Like my lashes aren't clumpy. They still feel soft. Mature skin video hacks. Guys, I promise you I'm working on it. One of Mitch's relatives agreed to come up and be our model. So I'm gonna try to schedule that with her soon. How old is Wendy? Oh, I have no idea. Oh, she. I'm not gonna say, call her out either. Well, she's gonna say it. No, there's nothing wrong with age. We all, we all age. I know. I'm just saying. It's gonna be helpful. Okay, never mind. I can't call out someone's age. I get it. It's totally fine. Okay, I'm gonna do my Dior blush. Dior one, right? 
Haley, I know I'm working on the mirrors. I promise you. We're we are oh, work what? That's sweet they asked about. Oh yeah, we're working on the mirrors. Okay, I'm gonna use the same brush because he didn't give me many, so <laughs> but this is a Dior 001 pink blush. What do you think about Sigma brushes? I don't like them. Sorry. Just they don't work for me. That's all. Nothing, no shade. No hate, no shade. I don't they don't work for me. Um, never been a big Sigma brush person. I've tried so many. Em but, you know, that doesn't mean that it won't work for other people, so. Emily says, can you do another guide oh. for non-makeup wearers? I love the first oh, one. Oh, Emily, I want to so yeah. bad. I had, I'm honestly, amazing. yeah, Mitch even liked that video, it's too. He was like, video. okay, so that video is our number one video, apparently. Yeah. Uh, Haley Refer is amazing. Amazing. They have, and they have great um, prices. Great, great prices. Love Refer. So, okay, so that's a Dior blush. Um, what else do we need to do? We need to do a lip. Yeah, I picked these two things. Okay, sorry, he picked out a lip. All right, you know what? Yeah. Okay, drum roll, please. He picks out these for the lip. But where's my lip liner? No lip liner? Uh, this one right here. That's Teddy eyeliner. Oh, well, can't you do that? Eyeliner? I don't know. What about this one? Okay. No good? Yeah, I just don't know if it's going to go with this lipstick. Well, okay. I don't know. It's very challenging. Lips are challenging. Okay, I don't know. Does it need to be brown? I, you, you told me. How about me. brown? Like that one. Oh, great. He picked a good one. Okay, so this is Nude Truffle from NYX. I love, love this lip liner so much. This is probably one of my top favorite drugstore lip liners. These are like, oh, you don't know. These are like, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I looked at you like you would know the price. These are like $8 and they're so good. So I'm going to put Nude Truffle on. I think you're being honest. I have oh, a set and I prefer it. My It Cosmetics brushes. Oh yeah, those are... It Cosmetics makes some great brushes, but they're very pricey. Okay. Oh, that's a pretty color. Mm-hmm. This actually goes great with this eyeshadow color. Yeah, new trouble is great. Okay, let me not ruin this. This is a dupe for Chocolate Cosmo. Love the... So I gotta think about that. Yeah. Let me think about that because it's a new color to me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Rachel says, "What is a Mac lip liner that you said is your favorite?" I think they're like four bucks. Yeah. A Mac lip liner. That's my go-to. Nude classic Mac shade. Oak mm -hmm. and strip down. Ah. And if you're a deep skin tone, chestnut. <sighs> it's stunning. Chestnut is always in my makeup kit. Okay, so this is the color he picked. Oh, this one, huh? I don't know if you're gonna, you're not gonna like it. I'm not gonna like it. Uh -oh. mm -mm. Okay, so the funny story about this lipstick. I did a, a reel using this. This is the Fenty Beauty Velvet Cream or Velvet something. Well, this one. I can't read, this is so small. Fenty Icon Velvet Liquid in 04 Riri. Oh yeah, Oak is the best, it's amazing. But I remember he didn't really love this what color. What if you just do oak all over and then do this gloss thing? Or Not this good. all over? Yeah, and then, the, yeah. Okay, I can do a little more of this. And then Tristan says, Tristan says, Mitch, you might need to give her something like a pencil brush to apply a deeper shade in, of eyeshadow. Yeah. That's a good point. I, I told I try you, to though, tell you should that. use that. You need to use that one that I sent you. This one right here. Is this a pencil brush? This kind of looks like a pencil. Mm-hmm, but... I guess I could use, he did give me this after I complained. Yeah, you're a complainer. All right, you know, I'm just gonna <laughs> do this lip liner. I, I, I know he's, I know for a fact he's not gonna like this, so I'm gonna put it down. Um, all right, he gave me this gloss. It's very glossy. This is from Clay de Poe. It's beautiful. Um, I'm just gonna go for it. Tristan, you're so sweet. Oh, this is pretty, babe. Oh yeah, I like this. this is Okay, I'm not mad about that. That's really pretty. I like that. Okay, so what do I need to do? I need to add Dark more depth. Breath. Okay, let's do. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I know what I like. I want to smoke out the bottom a little more. I thought you were going to do bottom lash line. Yeah, you didn't do your bottom lash line. Well, I didn't have the tool. You know what? This is Iron Chef, okay? You have to use Ooh, what you antique got. rose. That sounds pretty. You know, I need to try some of Wayne Goss's makeup. I don't know why I haven't yet. 
Does he have any stuff available in stores or no? Uh, no, I think it's all direct to consumer, mm -hmm. which is smart. Highs from Poland, Nikki, your work ethic and uh, unpretentious style is simply amazing. Oh my God, thank That's you. so endearing how confident and, oh man, I can't even read. Oh my gosh, she's so sweet. That is so sweet. Who said that? Communicatively, you guide. Oh. Aw, thank you so much for the sweet compliment. That was, uh, oh my gosh, I'm going to miss up the name. Oh man, we're missing a lot of questions now. Okay. Um, Classy Gal. Oh, thanks. Haley? Okay, so Wayne Goss is available at Beautylish. I'll need to check it out. I'll need to check out his stuff. I heard his brushes are really good. Or, or great, to be honest. Okay. I know we have to wrap this up. Why? These lives go by so fast. How long have we been live for? 55 minutes. Awesome. People need to go do stuff. And we need to eat. My stomach is growling so loud. I can eat. Every time I feel like growling, I just, I just try to talk so you guys don't hear it. Michelle says you are so stunning. Yeah, she. Oh, you you're are so stunning. sweet, Michelle. That's very nice of you. Do you guys think we should do this again every once in a while? Or yeah. Well, do you guys want Mitch was this back? A disaster. <laughs> was he too? Uh, are you too um, lost? Chaotic. Yeah, Chaotic. I'm definitely lost for sure. Chaotic. Oh, Adrian says you did great, Mitch. Oh, thanks, Adrian. That mop palette looks so gorgeous. This this mop palette, you guys, I'm just gonna show you one more time. This was really pretty. And like I said, these two are like the creams up top. And let me just try to show you the... Wait, what? Can you pass a look? Oh, it looks pretty. amazing, okay. yeah. Looks, He's got the I laptop so beautiful. down here. It looks much better on the laptop than it does on my iPhone. But this was really fun. Am I missing anything? Should I add anything to this makeup look? What am I let missing, look you guys? You. Look in the thing and I'm gonna I look help. at you. No, I have to pick it. Well, Mitch knows what goes in a whole look. Yeah, he he does, Melissa. <laughs> <laughs> well, you didn't do much. You like... look so pretty. I loved how it turned out. Thank you. It does look really pretty. Been a roll watching all your videos. Oh my god, that's so funny. Thank you so much. I hope they're entertaining. Those I think these are the most fun. entertaining, to be honest. Like it's so funny when I, you know, just a little side story, okay? When I watch our our videos, like when we're editing edit, editing them, I need to eat. It's a sure sign I need to eat. I can't talk. When we're editing them and I watch them back, I'm like, wow, I have no personality. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, wow, man, I need, I have like no soul. Like, why am I so like, but I just come across that way sometimes when I'm like trying to teach and I always like kick myself. I'm like, wow, like you're really like, I don't know. What? I just I sound really blah sometimes and I feel bad because then when we're on a live or if I'm on a live, like I can really just be myself. So Settings it's nice. Break. It's nice to mix it up, basically. It's nice to mix it up, do a live where we're not, you know, I don't have to be Thanks, Donna. perfect, well-spoken, clearly, because I am not, when I can't, when I don't eat, I can't talk at all. But it's nice to mix it up and have, like, the variety on my channel. So I hope you guys enjoy it. And um, I'm going to set my makeup before we run out of time. <laughs> I'm going to set my makeup with the Caudalie Beautily. I can't talk Beautily Elixir. <laughs> Beautily? Beauty Elixir. <laughs> this is a hard one, though. Caudalie Beauty Elixir. This smells so good. If you guys ever smell this, you know what I'm talking about. It smells like a spa. You nearly got me, says Mitch. You I know. Hear. I told him. He's been holding out. He's been holding out this whole time. He's like, we no. We 100,000. He goes, every time I bring this up, he goes, no, we don't have enough subscribers yet. It's going to be a waste. <laughs> Not going to be a waste? You said that. You said it's no. going to be a waste of your talent. You asked me when it was like, he said, oh, talent. <laughs> he said it's going to be a waste of my You're talent crazy. unless we have, you know, X amount of subscribers, which, by the way, Side note, hold on. I have things to say. That looks like a nice mist. You wanna try it? No. Really? No, I don't well, want it. Let me just try it, just what try it. It's, I don't want try it. Try it, just close your eyes. It's... <laughs> don't open yet. <laughs> it's, it smells interesting. Why did you do that to me? Is it sticky? No, it's just hydrating, it's oh, good for your okay, skin. Nice. Okay, before we wrap this up, I just wanna say, <laughs> Thank, we have a lot of new subscribers and I want to say thank you all to, oh, yeah. for, first of all, thank you all to all my OGs and all the people that join us every Sunday and for all the support. You guys are just amazing. You make YouTube and all the work so worth it, like 10 times worth it. So thank you all so much. But then also, if you're a new subscriber and you're catching this live, either during the live or later on, thank you for subscribing. Thanks mm -hmm. for joining us. Just big, big thank you to all the new subscribers that we've gotten this month. We've gotten a lot, and um, we're just so grateful. 
It's just amazing having you all. Yeah. Oh, are you sub yesterday? Welcome. Okay, so this is directed towards you. Thank you for joining us and, you know, uh, we just appreciate it. You know, we really, really do. It's amazing. Without you guys, we wouldn't have a, you know, viable channel. Yeah. Right? You work so hard at this yeah. channel, you know? Well, so do you. Um, but yeah, so thank you all so much. Thanks for joining us. To give Mitch a big uh, round of applause for Ooh. picking out my makeup. Oh, so you look great. Thank you. It's pretty. Yeah. We're going to go get some food because we're starving. Do you need more lip? You didn't do enough lip liner. Well, babe. Did you? I did. I did a ton of Guys, I did a lot of lip liner. Hold on. He, Mitch likes the lip liner. Well, so, I thought you were going to do it in the center too, no? Like the lip color. I did. I blended it in. Oh. Well, we got to go. Hi, everybody. Everyone's got to go. Hope you guys have the greatest... Sunday. Okay, I need to eat. I can't talk. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. If you're a new subscriber, thank you so much. We're so happy to have you. Let us know in the comments of this video if you want Mitch to come back. I think <laughs> yeah. it might, he, might need, he might need time to recover from the stress of picking out my makeup, but I think he did really well. So here's a last look at the makeup look. Everything will be listed below and I'll see you guys next Sunday. Bye. Bye, everybody. Say bye to Mitch. <laughs> I gotta go feed him. <laughs> All right. Bye, you guys. I love you.